It's a cream picture for the financial status of the free state municipalities. In a five-year period, the province has failed to produce any clean audits pointing to a collapse in local government. The Auditor General says the lack of political and administrative leadership has been obstruction to municipalities' effective performance. The province has been confronted with a series of service delivery protests in various municipalities, the infrastructure is collapsing and projects remain incomplete. Opposition parties assert that the outcomes are a reflection of poor services in the province. Some say heads should start rolling. We'll keep on putting pressure on the on Treasury and on COPTA uh, to, to assist these municipalities and also hold these municipal uh, officials, the senior officials accountable, and also the politicians. Uh, the Auditor General referred to that there's new councils now in place and that they should uh, take this and turn it around, the situation, the audit outcomes actually. But you can't because these uh, politicians appointed and that's governing from the ANC are the same officials that was appointed the previous term. The way situation is is going back to a question where the, uh, the Auditor General was raising to say uh, there's a lack of political will on the part of the leadership of the province so we must really begin to act, to act especially the Premier because yes, she has promised that she's going to act against maladministration, against Corruption. The ANC is not a liberation movement, it's a desperation movement. Our municipalities are bankrupt, and it's not me that says so, it's the MEC for Kochto who actually recently acknowledged this fact in a portfolio committee in the Free State Legislature. Our municipalities have been regarded as employment services and employment scheme for years for only a few ANC cadres while it's not improving the lives of our people, they have not contributed to these uh, municipalities. The ANC says it has been focusing on ensuring that governance in municipalities change. We are happy that the, the, the report of the AG reveals what uh, the, the interim provincial committee had identified and that we, 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 are, we are at the moment uh, assisting to ensure that we we changed the situation, working together with um, all the deployees of the ANC in, in municipalities. The Free State Department of Cooperative Governance concedes that drastic actions are needed to turn the situation around. We are quite confident that the situation will turn around. Obviously, we will not be overzealous, uh, we will not be irrationally optimistic. We will look at what it is that can be achieved within what period of time, set those goals uh, and not just dream about things uh, improving for the better, set ourselves goals and measure ourselves against those goals that we've set ourselves. The Auditor General has warned that the provincial leadership should be very concerned about this state of affairs. Maluleke says a lack of consequence management create a culture of complete disregard for the rule of law. Mahalama Sting, SABC News, Bluefontaine.